what's in my travel bag? Slash hand luggage, all that jazz, but travel bag sounds better, I reckon. So this is what my travel bag looks like. And I thought I'd do one of these coming back from California. I still had a few stuff in it and I just took my makeup out and stuff. So I just put it back in and I'm just gonna get right into this video because my camera's gonna die soon. So this is a backpack from Anna Smith and it's just black and it's spotty with leather lining around the pockets with buckles like that and you don't actually have to undo them they're just like boom slash i just broke it oh well <laughs> and then on this bit it has a toggle you have to pull and it's pretty secure so no one can rub your stuff so the first thing i can see in here is my makeup bag <laughs> and if you guys want to see a what's in my makeup travel bag thing then you can give this video a thumbs up and comment down below if you want to see one of those separately but quick review it's just in a clear plastic thing because i had to like you know they have to see it and stuff in the airport so i've just got some fun looking nail varnishes in here to touch up my nails and stuff some lip balms some eyeshadow powders and stuff like that so that's what it looks like and i've got like my little applying beauty blender sponge from real techniques so that's that and then next in here is my vlogging camera it wasn't the case but i don't know where it is now and i took this everywhere with me because i wanted to vlog the whole trip and i did so that will be up on my channel soon and it's a little touchscreen camera and it's really really good apart from the battery kept on dying most the time i was there so i didn't get as much footage as i wanted so next i have a purse with all my coins in and this is just in case the airport and stuff um, before I went away I wanted to get some stuff I did take another purse I don't remember which purse it was oh yeah I took a red purse and it had all my dollars in and stuff and then obviously I gave the teacher some of my dollars because I didn't want to be carrying on like $500 in there or anything so that's that and this hey guys I'm back because um, my battery died again so I was talking about my purse and then my DS and then what's in here my ipod case there's no ipod in it but i took my ipod touchscreen because i wanted to listen to music and my mum and dad didn't want me taking my ipod in case it broke in america so that was to check on facebook and all that jazz and keep in touch with my family and my other friends and all that so i had that with me that had an ipod in not just a case and then to go with that i had my headphones because like music and all that and i bought my headphones weren't that great these are actually my friend's headphones steps because i forgot to get them back to her i had to buy a few from service stations on the way down to london because mine were rubbish apple ones they were just dead and they were rubbish but these are amazing i think these are like sony Ericsson ones or um samsung ones i'm pretty sure they are um I had a pair of these ages ago because I had a Samsung phone and they are amazing. They're like better than Apple by like 10 times. Um, I have a hand warmer in here because my, 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 my skiing instructor gave it to me on the last day. And I've already used one of them and it has like these little details on here. I'm not going to show you there. It's just like Alpine Meadows card ski instructor thing. And then I have some tissues in here, and um, some batteries, and um, I have some of the stuff I have put in again, is a notepad because I like to doodle on a plane. I have a pen with that, and it's here. So this is from, let's say, I don't know if it's going to say, no, but it's just a really, really nice patterned, um, notebook and it's got blank pages in like that and it feels it's a felty kind of feeling and it's really nice and it's just nice to draw on 11 hour flight <laughs> and then i got two magazines in the airport so that is 17 and a lot a lot i hope i'm pronouncing that right so mark conrad's on this and is it lee mitchell lee michelle lee mitchell i think it is on that one and i got so excited i found a 17 magazine in the london airport i was like i'll get one of those in america and then i saw it and i just ran over and grabbed it so in my blog i kind of give you a look through this because i was so bored in it and then i found mega rosette in it so got excited and i found that really good 
good and then this one's a lot thicker and it's got Lauren Conrad on the front and these are just good to read and I just read them all over again slash I got some really um, like $10 off things if you spend like $50 or over and like Aeropostale and stuff like that so guys that concludes my what's in my travel bag and uh, when I go on holiday I normally take my iPad with me and um, that's just a white iPad when I go with my family and then like I obviously like take bubbles and stuff but that is the end of what's in my travel bag because it's empty guys and it's really light I wish it was that light carrying around the airport so thank you very much for watching and if you enjoyed this give it a thumbs up and comment down below any ideas you want because I am filming all the time now and I've got the camera sorted and all that so I'm really happy about it so thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys later bye